Have you ever wanted to give your Raspberry Pi the power to see in the dark? In this quick tutorial, we'll turn the Pi 5 into an infrared obstacle detection machine, which you can use for your next robotics or security project. First of all, what is an IR sensor? An IR infrared sensor uses infrared light to detect objects or movement. Common modules have an IR emitter in the form of LED and a receiver in the form of a photodiode or a phototransistor. When an object is closed, the sensor typically outputs a digital high or low signal, allowing the Raspberry Pi to react accordingly. When it comes to wiring your IR sensor to the Raspberry Pi 5, assuming that you're working with a 3-pin IR sensor module labeled VCC, ground and out, connect the VCC to pin 1 on the Pi. Most IR sensors can run at 3.3 volts or 5 volts, but just to confirm, just check your data sheet. After connect the ground pin with any of the ground pins within the Raspberry Pi, in my case, I'm connecting it to pin 6 on the Pi. And lastly, for the out, connect that with GPIO 14 or pin 8 on the Pi. You can choose a different GPIO pin, just update the code. And this is the code that I'll be running. And how the code works is that for the setup, there's the GPIO.set mode, which means that we're using the board home numbering system for pins. And when it comes to reading, there's the GPIO.input sensor pin, which gives us GPIO high or GPIO low, depending on whether the sensor sees an object. And the loop prints a detection status every 0.5 seconds. Once you've run the code, you should be able to get a response that says obstacle detected or obstacle not detected. As you can see, when I'm placing an object, which is a remote controller in front of the Hi, I'm getting obstacles detected. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.